The building at 2218 West Franklin Street, currently home to Weber Equipment, was formerly known as Eckler Garage. The structure was built in 1923 by the Franklin Corporation. Robert Eckler, with co-owners John Cox and John Davis, sought to bring a car dealership to the west side of Evansville. Scarborough Davis Company contracted Charles Trotman to design the building. The building was built in a commercial vernacular style. The Eckler Garage building is a large brick structure, two stories in height. Across the front of the building are banks of large industrial windows on the second floor and large plate glass windows on the first. The building is divided into four sections framed by brick pilasters with limestone caps and a limestone band along the top of the second floor windows. The top of the facade is lined with a limestone cornice and atop the cornice are five urns. This building featured a runway ramp to the second floor which hadn't previously been done. Eckler Garage opened in September of 1923 and sold Ford and Lincoln automobiles. Eckler Garage went out of business in the early 1930s and was home to numerous used auto dealerships and a furniture warehouse for the next 40 years. Many Westsiders will remember Lloyd's Auto Sales, Warner Auto Sales, and Moto Warehouse as occupants of this building. In 1978, it was bought and renamed Weber Equipment. Today, Weber Equipment is owned by Kathy and Patrick Willett and has been renovated while keeping the name Weber Equipment.